not coming in or finding, working with the team to prevent that defects from coming. It's easy to find defects, right? The moment we put ourselves in a situation where we want to be accountable or we want to be tracked for the number of defects that we are identifying, we are putting ourselves as a, as a regular tester. Grow up. We don't want to be a tester anymore, right? Our job is not to just sit and test. There are, there are automated stuff that are coming in. We need to add value to the whole process, right? We need to add value to the whole process. So therefore, we need to be standing up and then saying, hey, I've got X number of defects. I want to work with you to figure out how I can reduce these defects, how I can prevent these defects from coming in. What can we work together? Because as a tester, you understand the end-to-end -end testing life cycle, right? You understand how the whole journey is happening. If I understand the journey that's happening, can I work with you to enable? And that's where you add value to yourself. That's where you grow up the value chain. And people don't look at you then as a regular tester. People look at you as a value creator. And that's what I'm challenging. Now, I don't have a precise metric to, to arrive at. But I think we need to start thinking towards that. We are not here to just test and then say, my job is to create 100 faults. Faults will be there. As long as software development is there, rest assured, faults will be there. No technology that has come so far has, although we have said it has improved our life, has it improved our life beyond a point? It has only complicated our lives, right? Tell me which technology, mobile. I have unashamedly, I'm going to show off my phone. Sorry, sir. <laughs> this is my phone. I've gone back to this phone, and my life is much more peaceful. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we have uh, you know uh, come to end of this panel discussion. A warm round of applause to all the panel members. Okay, so uh, we have the next generation testing survey going to start now. So in your kit. There is a survey form which KPMG uh, is, is conducting. And while you take out this form, let me uh, thank our sponsors, our platinum sponsors, Startup Consulting Services, Tech Mahindra, and CA Technologies, our knowledge partner, KPMG, and our bronze partner, Test Mile, Last Mile, Test Insane, and Agile Testing Alliance. You have uh, a write-up about these companies, what they do, what they specialize on uh, in the kit that has been provided to you. Uh, we have five minutes to fill up this survey. Uh, we, we, we thank all the panel members. Maybe you can also join in you know, giving your inputs to the survey. The survey is very important. We are not asking you to reveal your name, your company. We want to get the real story of software testing in India. The world is looking at us. They want to know what is our capability, how do we think, how we are optimistic, or whether we are optimistic or pessimistic about our career. All such, all such things would be revealed tomorrow by KPMG. The, the result would be shared with all of you. The, in, the inputs will go into what we call World, world uh, Next Generation Testing Survey, and it will be circulated across the globe so what you are entering is of immense importance. Try to be truthful, try to be honest. We have five minutes to complete this survey. Once you have done this survey, please hand it over to the nearest Unicom person you know, next to you. If you do not have the survey with you, please raise your hand. We'll get the survey form you know, uh, to you at the earliest. I can see few of us consulting among yourselves <laughs> to get the answer. You know, give your honest opinion. It doesn't reveal anything about your company. It reveals about how you feel. <coughs> Rest of you can fill the form. We have something called Unicorn Thought Leadership Program, and we have three emerging thought leaders. 